Hello friends, this is Rupesh and I'm watching C Webinars video series on C14 feature list and this video is about deprecated attribute. Yes, this is an attribute which you will apply on all these things actually. So what is this deprecated keyword? Let's suppose you have this function, right? There is this main and you want to print what is this add one and two and this will add and this will just return it. And this is pretty cool code, right? But let's suppose you want to deprecate it. Deprecate means you want to mark this function as outdated because you wanted to go for a generic template based add function and you no longer want to use this in next release or next to next release or you just want to tell to the people that stop using this function start using some another function or we will build some another function so don't rely on this function much so before c 14 it was not possible actually to mark some function deprecated but now it is possible and there are two syntax okay I'll, I'll i'll write that syntax when we will code but let's go through these two comments and then we'll go for the code first comment is deprecated means use of the name or entity declared with this attribute is allowed but discouraged for some reason we will not restrict the use of this add function we will just give a message that this is getting outdated or something so you please stop using this and we have some another add function for you and if you want to give the reason you can give the reason in the comment section we'll talk about that also and that comment thing is really very cool so be with me we'll see that so the second point is compiler give warning and if string literals are provided they are included in the warning yes actually when you write some function as deprecated if you will write the deprecated attribute here when you will compile it compiler will give you the warnings saying that this is deprecated but when you are writing deprecated here along with this deprecated keyword you can actually give the reason or some message for reader to read okay why it is deprecated or what is the next step we are taking to actually replace this or whatever okay and this deprecated can be used with classes structure unions type div variable and blah 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 stuff so there are these many things we you can use deprecated on so let's quickly see the program and we'll sum this video. So as I said, the syntax for deprecated is you have to write it like deprecated and you're done. That's it. You don't have to do anything else. Just this much. Okay. And that comment thing I'll show later, but let's first compile this. So if we will compile this, let's compile this. Okay. See, it is giving you some nice warning saying that this ad is deprecated correct it is not an error it's just a warning saying that ad is deprecated but there is no reason right so let's write the reason for actually better understanding this function will be replaced with template add function okay and this is a quite good reason so let's compile this again and you will see this warning now see add is deprecated this function will be replaced with template and function so actually when you deprecate something you actually have that function so that people will see this warning and will start using that function so it's not necessary for me to actually write that function and show you the example i know you have understood this right this is looking very small but if you are working in some company so there are so many times people discourage to use some functions because there is another function which does the same job and that is more optimized but before this c 14 we didn't had any option or any attribute like this but now we do okay so thanks for watching and yeah don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this so i'll see you in the next videos Bye bye